should have run. I'd have, I'd have brought his gear in. Oh, this is stupid phone. Hey, can you just stand still a second? Talk to me. I've not come here for a chat. Well, too bad, because we need one. Look, you've spent all night with Lachlan. You can just give me a second. You take some time out. Time out? OK. I'm sorry, that was a bad choice of words. I get that. If I... you did, you never would have left him in the first place. I'm sorry, Lachlan's stealing from your dad and selling those pills. That's not down to me leaving him alone for a few hours. But him almost dying is. OK, fine. Lash out. I can take that. But he's going to want to try stuff, and you breathing down his neck is only going to make it worse. Is that what I do? Breathe down his neck? Well, you want to protect him? Yeah, well, I failed at that then, haven't I? No. Do you think I drove him to this? No, God, no. No, I did, didn't I? No wonder he wanted to escape. That's why he sent me to pick up his things. Just to get me out of his face. Chris, just, yeah. No, and just... That'll be wondering where I am. Can you just... Can you just look after things here, please? Well, Chris, I want to help. Well, well, this is how. Just stay here, please. Do you know me boots are getting wrecked here? Did you a favour? Oh, ha, 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 at the fashion place. Stupid place to park. Oh, yeah. Um, listen, love, you take Cheryl home, will you, and I'll just be a few minutes. You're supposed to be looking after the B&B. &B. You'll be late back. Jacob, just go, right? <laughs> <laughs> Chris here. It's OK. I'm, I'm OK. Um, please, could you just go, please? No, I'm sorry, I can't. Not where you like this. <laughs> Is it your son? Is he all right? Yeah, he's, he's fine. Um, he's fine till the, till the next time. Oh, the joys of bringing up boys, eh? <sighs> Our Jacob's not ever hit puberty yet and already he's a trouble magnet. Oh, yeah, well, he's not the same. No, oh, once those hormones take hold, who can tell, eh? Trust me, it's not, not the hormones. It's, um... It's just who he is. And, and I just... I, I think I'm out of my depth. <laughs> This way you tell me it's not my fault. <laughs> That'd be a bit pointless, wouldn't it? Look, I know what it's like to look away for two minutes only for your child to nearly die. You blame yourself and you shouldn't. The thing is, I didn't look away. Not completely. Robert said he'd look after him till I got back. Right, so Lachlan snuck out then? No. Robert did. Apparently, some meeting was more important than the safety of my son, so... Is it so wrong just to want to keep an eye on my son all the time? No, of course it's not. Oh, God. I can't face any more sympathy. Um... Look, right, there must be another way of you looking out for your son other than... Locking him away? <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, David started this football thing now. You know, that'd keep Lachlan busy. Okay. Can I think about it? I just, I, I really need to go. I just want to go home. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. OK. Hey, <sighs> well, something happened with Lachlan. Is he worse? Oh, no, nothing like that. Well, then what? She just thinks she's a really rubbish mum. I mean, all she did was trust her fiancé to keep an eye on her son, he just stopped and disappeared. Why? Well, he said he had a meeting. Yeah, she didn't look too convinced by that excuse either. 